This video does not encourage or condone the use of substances. All mentions of narcotics are purely for entertainment purposes and should not be taken seriously. Alright, so you ever take like way too much Adderall? Like so much Adderall you can feel every neuron in your brain firing at once? Like so much Adderall it feels like there's a cat scratching at the back of your brain? Oh yeah. That hits the spot. If you answered yes to this question, I have a little music genre you might like. And this is called Dariacore. Why is it called that? I have no clue. Let's find out. Uh, Dariacore. Uh. Uh. I, I'm pretty sure it's called. I'm pretty. Where the f is my pop filter? I'm gonna mount this b up real quick. My apologies. Basically, there was this artist called, uh, Dultsk, D-L-T-Z-K, Dultsk. <laughs> I, s I swear there was a way to pronounce it, but a lot of people like to think that Jane Remover is solely responsible for this, but I don't really like to think that a whole genre is the responsibility of one person. Seems to be a few people who disagree. I know, I know this isn't dead ass, but you may be asking yourself, what the f is a dairy accord what that just sounds like what happens after i eat way too much taco bell well nah let me tell you this genre of music is exactly what 10 year old me would have wanted to listen to when i was bumping owl city on my ipod nano i was so obsessed with like the edm drops i listened to a bunch of calvin harris and owl city there's this one song called like speed of love that really hit i really messed with edm drops but i couldn't really like get my hands on the good ones. I also remember wanting to buy Bangarang for my iPod, but there was like inappropriate lyrics or something, so my mom was like, mm -mm -mm, you can't have that. So I, I was never able to fully immerse myself in my love of EDM, okay? And this, this is precisely what I would have wanted. Well, uh, let me give you a few previews. <laughs> that how about a few more yo uh shout out Aaron. <laughs> Oh my god, that is the cat synth. The fucking meow synth. That shit goes so hard. <laughs> this one's excellent. <laughs> This one's actually by fucking Dultsk. Alright, so today I'm gonna be showing you how you can do a Daria core. Ignore my fucking Jesus fucking Christ. Alright, so first off, let's make a let's make a little list of what we need for our Daria core track. So the first thing you're gonna need before you make Daria core is a stimulant of choice. Now if you don't know what a stimulant is, there's things like uh, coffee, anything with caffeine really. So if you're into that, you can have a couple cups of coffee or something. If you're a little more extreme, you can get into some energy drinks perhaps, maybe a little Red Bull, some, some bull testicle, uh, maybe a bang energy if you like uh, heart attacks. But um, for me, cocaine. Now it really doesn't matter which stimulant you choose, just know that if coffee is on one end of the scale, cocaine is on the other end of the scale, and the more stimulants you have, the better your dairy accord is gonna be. So just, just give me one moment. Oh! Oh yeah! Aight! Let's get into this. So what else can we add? So you're gonna want a BPM that's uncomfortably high. So we're talking like 160 to 200 type shit, aight? Alright, next thing you're gonna need is an acapella from anything. It, it doesn't even matter. It could be your fucking grandpa's funeral's favorite song. Preferably, uh, nostalgic, modern, or nostalgic. Who the fuck cares? Not me. Then, uh, the next thing you're gonna need is, um, a drum kit of some kind. Now, you can use any drum kit you want for this, but preferably you're gonna need, um, hyperpop drums. Basically, what you're gonna need is shit from A Hunted Gex, Break Ins, any of those songs with, like, the crazy ass drums. I'm sure if I just do this, Daria Core Drum Kit 
Reddit. If you want to be the most generic motherfucker on planet Earth, use this drum kit. Next thing you're gonna need is any fucking synth plugin, but preferably a good one. So for this one, I'm gonna use Serum, which I legally purchased, of course. I would never download anything illegally. We already know this. Let's keep going about this checklist. Um, what else do we need? No, that's about it. <sighs> this motherfucker's back. Or, or... Bro, do you mind? Oh. My bad, I... Right, and then you're gonna need random ass sound effects. These can be from Vine, or your favorite video game, or whatever the fuck. It doesn't fucking matter. Sound effects. Alright, let's get into this. And for this, I'm gonna be using... Hey, okay, shut up! I'm better at producing in Logic, okay? I don't need to hear any shit talking. All right, so check this out. Uh, <laughs> uh, we don't worry about that. All right, now I already made this shit. I ain't gonna lie, but let's check this out, shall we? So first off, you're gonna wanna make some chords. And to do that, you're not gonna wanna ask me. I don't know shit about music theory, okay? I just, I just write out what sounds good. For this one in particular, oh my God, this fucking guy. Yo. Bro, I just started that fucking new job, right? Yeah. And then, bro, I was off an Addy, and they fucking caught me jacking off in the back and fired me. <laughs> Can't think about anything else other than fucking beating the shit out of my car. <laughs> really not my fault. <laughs> bro, fuck, dude. I mean, where else do you have to go? At this point, it's either fucking only fans or... Actually, yeah, probably just only fans. <laughs> Set it to a high-ass BPM. 180. This is perfect. Now let's listen to these chords I made. Now that's a saucy-ass melody if I do say so myself. So as it turns out, I'm a little bitch, and I did not make this melody myself. This is from a fucking unison MIDI chord pack. It's definitely changed my life. Not mine. This might be one of the most embarrassing things ever. <laughs> um, what you can do to make something like this is you, um, you basically you take like some chords. So I had the dun dun dun. Like it's like you have the bass. Please, uh, just don't ask me how to make chords. So here we go. Now you whip this up in Serum. As you can see here, I used a fucking preset because I can't do shit on my own. Let's listen to it. Then right there, as you can see, we go straight to the drop. For the drop, we have these chords again. It actually looks like I made this synth myself, even though it says Synthioshi City. Basically what you do to get this kind of effect is you, um, what the fuck is this? Okay, so it looks like for this one, I just took that same preset and I turned off the filter, which was making it do that boom, boom, boom. So now it's just pure synth. And then if you crank this unison, you can get more voices, and if you do uh, detune, these like separates the voices. So if we listen to it, you can see it's detuned to shit. But if we put them more together, it's gonna sound good. So basically, this consists of like two synths put together, and this one's an octave up, and then uh, this one's. Sounds pretty and all that. All right, let's see what else we got. Then you get yourself a little, little lead, and it looks like this one is also a fucking preset. Yes, sir. Don't do anything yourself. That would be too creative. All right, let's see here. So that's our little melody right there. And then we have our bass, of course. And for this, I actually sampled the the breakins bass. I have the I have this glide thing turned up a little bit. So if you overlap the notes, like right right here where I have these overlapped, it'll like glide into each other and sound nice. And then we have our drums. Now this is essential. So we have the Valentine kick. Oh, that clipping. Got the bed squeak. And of course we have this fucking snare that everyone uses. And of course something else you need is uh, these like DMB breaks. We go to the second drop, the leads are the same and we have a different set of fucking drums.
the other things you're gonna need are these um these sound effects and transitions and shit. <laughs> And of course, who could forget? Ah! Yeah, that's pretty much all you need. So let's give this, let's give this a little listen, shall we? That's about it. This might be a really shitty tutorial, but it's chill. Alright, see ya.